What is good, everybody, and welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Space. I know I've been going, man. I know, I know. Just parts haven't been showing up, bro. Like, <laughs> I'm building two cars, so parts have not been coming in. It's very slow, you know. I'm sure you guys can understand. But in today's video, I have a harness bar that I want to install that I got in. And I'm going to show you guys step by step. If you're interested in doing one or if you have something similar to what I have, you can install it probably the same exact way. All right. So first things first, what you want to do is these are your brackets. So this will be for the left side and they'll sit like this. So let me show you guys. Here's the right side. Those are the bars that go down to the bottom bolt. And this is obviously your big harness bar. Uh, my bolts are, are on the other side, but it, all, it comes with everything. Everything that you need comes inside the box. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is get these brackets up first, right? Then I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side. You have to remove the top center column, which is this piece. And you might have to do some trimming as well. Yeah, for sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that side and then I'm gonna go ahead and find the bolt for bottom for down there. And then we're gonna run the bar first. Okay, so taking a quick look at this, it looks like I'm gonna have to sacrifice some carpet in order to get the bolt in flush with the swivel piece. So I'm gonna see how that works and I'm gonna just cut it more if I need to, but that should be enough. Okay, so here's what it looks like with one side mounted up. If you order this kit, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Um, this, uh, it's not all the way bolted down. I still have room to like play and stuff, but this bracket goes sideways, but it looks, it looks like it's supposed to be like this and these brackets are not like not everything is secured so how you see it is pretty much just like a rough mock-up uh, i'm gonna go ahead and put the other side on and um i'm gonna see what happens when i bolt everything down but for the most part it looks like it's supposed to sit that way because my seat goes all the way back. So that's what it will look like. Not bad. Tell me what you guys think down below. I mean, for me, it looks kind of weird because I usually see them straight, but this will be fine. I mean, granted it is eBay, and this is like a universal piece. To be honest, I didn't fully like measure everything. So for me to just do this one shot, it's pretty cool. I like it at least. Let me go ahead and do the other side and uh, get back to you when everything's like bolted down. One thing I do suggest about the bar is putting these brackets on first and then having it go in. Because if you put the brackets in first, like how I did in the beginning, um it's not this side or one side is probably not going to want to go in so this is the best way to do it it's putting them on this bracket first and then putting them in it takes a little persuasion but it's well worth it okay so here's something that i definitely learned all right this kit it works the bracket clears the door no mishaps this is how it's supposed to sit so what I did was, since I was taking my seatbelt stuff off, I took this bolt, right? Which is the longer version. I used the OEM one because it's a little bit longer. There's a side where one is bigger and one is smaller. Okay. So the, the bigger one always goes at the bottom. The smaller one goes at the top. 
and then this bolt is threaded on this end okay which receives the bracket and it sits like this okay so now this side is completely finished i don't have to touch the side anymore now i'm going to the driver's check side check this out i already had it wrong so this side is the smaller side so the bigger side goes down there okay <sighs> now i just want it to match that length No, that's loose. This stuff is almost like reverse thread. I, I would say like, honestly, this install is not bad. You just need a lot of patience. All right, that's perfect. Let me get my tripod and set you guys up real quick. Okay. So I got you guys set up already. The same bolt that I use for the other side, for the bottom, for the seat bolts, I'm using in this one. I'm probably going to have to take this one back off eventually until I get either a nut that actually works there. But that's fine for now. Let me zip the bottom. There. Hmm. All right. Besides this right here, everything is pretty much all set. I got everything bolted up. It's nice and sturdy. I like it. So this is the final product. I like it, man. <laughs> that shit is clean. Okay. Let me go ahead and um give you guys the part number if you're interested. That's the name of the company. You know what? I'm going to just screenshot the post and I'm going to put it on the screen right now. So pretty much, guys. I know I've been gone for like three weeks, I'm not gonna lie, but I have so much planned. It's just parts are not coming in. You know, it's not me having lack of work or stuff like that. I have plenty to do. I just don't have all my parts that I wanna do just yet. So I thought I was able to bring you guys at least something. Um, I don't have the harnesses just yet. I wanna actually like take my time with those. The reason why I actually got that bar was because <sighs> two reasons. Like I said, I'm not running regular seat belts. I wanted harnesses. That was always my image for this car. Always wanted harness bars. And second of all, imagine me riding, right? Me driving around and you guys right here. Like, tell me that's not going to be great content. <laughs> like, I could put my GoPro. I could set it up either on my head or there. Whatever works best. And... When it's time to go, you know, I could bring you guys with me for sure. Because now I have a place to put you guys. So, yeah, man. I hope everybody's safe. I hope everybody's healthy. And, um, yeah, until the next video. Shout out to everybody who has been subscribing and commenting on the page. You know, always make sure that, I almost bust my ass. Always make sure that you guys get that, that love and that 
that reply that I give to everybody else. You know, I, I talk to everyone, everyone, like in my comment section. So don't be scared, man. If you have a question, I can answer it. Um, if you feel more comfortable DMing me, you know, my Instagram is always in the link in the description. And um, yeah, man, just thank you guys so much. I appreciate all of you. Peace out.